Hey everyone! Welcome to this video where we'll be solving the hard-level New York Times Sudoku puzzle for July 30, 2024. Let's get started. Let's move to number 1. Only two positions left in the fifth box where value 1 can be placed. No other boxes have just two candidate cells available for the value 1. Let's move to number 2. In the second block, the number 2 can be directly placed. Let's move to number 3. In the second block, the number 3 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the third box where value 3 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 3 can be placed. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 3 can be placed. Let's move to number 4. Only two positions left in the first box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the second box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fifth box where value 4 can be placed. Let's move to number 5. In the third block, the number 5 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 5 can be placed. Only two positions left in the eighth box where value 5 can be placed. Let's move to number 6. There are no cells that can be filled with it, and there are no boxes with only two possible positions for it. Therefore, we will skip this number for now. Let's move to number 7. Only two positions left in the second box where value 7 can be placed. Let's move to number 8. There's nothing we can do with it right now. Let's move to number 9. There is only one possible value for cell row 6 column 4, which is 8. After eliminating all other numbers in its row, column, and block, the cell can only be filled with the value 8. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 8 can be placed. Only two positions left in the eighth box where value 8 can be placed. In the seventh block, the number 8 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the first box where value 8 can be placed. Only two positions left in the first box where value 6 can be placed. Please note that the cells marked in purple contain number pairs. In the first block, the number 9 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the first box where value 1 can be placed. In the fourth block, the number 1 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 3 can be placed. Only two positions left in the first box where value 2 can be placed. There is a hidden pair in the box 1. Notice how the candidates 1, 2 occur in only two cells in this. We have two candidates and only two cells where they can be placed in box 1. Therefore all other candidates can be removed from these two cells. Only one position left in the first box where value 6 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 2 can be placed. Only two positions left in the seventh box where value 2 can be placed. Only two positions left in the seventh box where value 3 can be placed. Only two positions left in the second box where value 9 can be placed. Only two positions left in the second box where value 8 can be placed. Please note that the cells marked in purple contain number pairs. Only two positions left in the fifth box where value 9 can be placed. In the fifth block, the number 7 can be directly placed. Please note that the cells marked in purple contain number pairs. Only one position left in the second box where value 7 can be placed. Only one position left in the second box where value 8 can be placed. Only one position left in the fifth box where value 1 can be placed. Only one position left in the eighth box where value 8 can be placed. 
only two positions left in the eighth box where value 4 can be placed. There is an intersection with another region in subgrid 8, value 4 has to be in one of the marked cells. So it cannot be in any other cell in column 4. Only one position left in the fifth box where value 4 can be placed. Only one position left in the fifth box where value 9 can be placed. Only 6 is missing in the fifth box. Only 9 is missing in the fifth column. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 4 can be placed. Only two positions left in the fourth box where value 6 can be placed. In the seventh block, the number 6 can be directly placed. Please note that the cells marked in purple contain number pairs. Only two positions left in the eighth box where value 6 can be placed. In the fourth block, the number 7 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 6 can be placed. Only one position left in the fourth box where value 2 can be placed. Only 5 is missing in the fourth box. Only one position left in the sixth box where value 5 can be placed. Only one position left in the sixth box where value 3 can be placed. Only two positions left in the seventh box where value 5 can be placed. In the seventh block, the number 7 can be directly placed. In the eighth block, the number 7 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the eighth box where value 4 can be placed. In the ninth block, the number 4 can be directly placed. Only one position left in the sixth box where value 4 can be placed. Only one position left in the sixth box where value 8 can be placed. Only 6 is missing in the fourth row. Only 9 is missing in the eighth row. Only two positions left in the third box where value 6 can be placed. In the ninth block, the number 7 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the ninth box where value 3 can be placed. There is an intersection with another region in subgrid 9, value 3 has to be in one of the marked cells. So it cannot be in any other cell in row 7. Only one position left in the seventh box where value 3 can be placed. Only one position left in the seventh box where value 2 can be placed. In the ninth block, the number 2 can be directly placed. Only two positions left in the third box where value 2 can be placed. There is an intersection with another region in subgrid 3, value 2 has to be in one of the marked cells. So it cannot be in any other cell in row 2. Only one position left in the first box where value 2 can be placed. Only one position left in the first box where value 1 can be placed. Only one is missing in the third row. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 1 can be placed. Only two positions left in the ninth box where value 1 can be placed. Only two positions left in the sixth box where value 2 can be placed. In the ninth block, the number 6 can be directly placed, please note that the cells marked in purple contain number pairs. Only one position left in the third box where value 6 can be placed. Only one position left in the third box where value 2 can be placed. Only one position left in the sixth box where value 2 can be placed. Only one position left in the sixth box where value 1 can be placed. Only one position left in the eighth box where value 6 can be placed. Only one position left in the eighth box where value 5 can be placed. Only one position left in the seventh box where value 5 can be placed. Only one position left in the ninth box where value 1 can be placed. 
Only one position left in the ninth box where value 3 can be placed. Only one position left in the third box where value 3 can be placed. Only 9 is missing in the sixth box. Only 9 is missing in the seventh box. Only 8 is missing in the eighth column. Only one position left in the first box where value 8 can be placed. Only one position left in the first box where value 4 can be placed. Only one position left in the second box where value 4 can be placed. Only one position left in the second box where value 9 can be placed. Only 9 is missing in the third box. This is the final result of the puzzle. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you never miss a video. Thanks again for tuning in and happy puzzling.